So this is the Canon 5D Mark II. This was the first camera I started to make money with. I had a lot of different cameras in my life, but this camera right here was the camera I wanted to have forever. I remember when it came out in about 2011 or 2012, I don't remember quite frankly, but this is the camera that I want. At first when it came out, I think it was like $3,000, which was a lot of money back then. And the specs nowadays are really basic. I mean, I think it's 21 megapixels and it shoots video at like 1080p, 30 frames a second. And basically when it first came out, I was super pumped about the specs. I mean, it was unbelievable. Before that, I had a film camera and I remember having like a Canon 20D or 30D, something like that. I was really young, but this was the first camera I bought with my own money. And I was really, really, really satisfied about the result. I mean, I've used this camera throughout many years and I think the last time I've used it, because now uh, it's completely toasted. I think I've shot like 200,000 photos with this. But basically I stopped using this camera in 2021, end of 2021, beginning of 2022. You know, I did a lot of client shoots. I'm gonna probably throw in a couple of photos to show you. But this camera was a workhorse. I have a bit of nostalgia when it comes to the sound of the mirror. You know, that whole thing. I don't know if you guys can see the whole thing you used to flip up and down and used to make that big ass noise when you used to shoot photos. I miss that thing. And one other thing I miss with this, now you know I switched to mirrorless cameras and now my camera is really small, but really powerful. But you know, the, the whole size of the camera changed and I miss the whole dynamic of the buttons. It had a joystick. It had a joystick, big old roulette, a lot of buttons onto that, but I remember how convenient and practical that camera was. When I started filming videos with this, you remember 1080p, 30 frames per second maximum, you could shoot 24 frames a second. I remember I downloaded a file which you could import uh, a log profile into the camera, which I put into it. It was an 8-bit color. It was not, it was not high quality, but you know, it, it did the job back then. And I remember putting a Rode Video Micro on top of it. And that was my setup. That's how I used to shoot vlogs. That's how I used to shoot interviews and everything. And you know what? In video, it didn't have autofocus. So it made me practice my manual focusing. All this to say that this is the Canon 5D Mark II. This camera was released 13 years ago. It was a long while back then. And the specs were incredible. And I used it till the end of 2022. So the R5 was out. A lot of Sonys were out. So we're talking about 50, 60 megapixels camera, 4K, 10 bit color, um, HDR, log profiles and everything all included in the camera body. And me personally, I used to work with this. I used to make all my photos and videos with this and I was able to make money out of it. And I was able to live out of a $400 camera that I bought from Marketplace. And I see nowadays a lot of people complaining about the specs of their camera. Their camera cost $3,000, $4,000, just as when this camera came out and it's not sufficient for them. You see, I started to make money with something that we would call today as garbage. And I still think this camera is really valuable. So for you, what was your first camera? What did you start with? And would you still use it today? Let me know in the comments. And if you like this little video, I recommend you subscribe to the channel and keep yourself updated for future content. See ya.